welcome today i'm going to show you my top 10 favorite health and beauty items for this month so let's get going shall we first up i'm going to show you this this is the floral collection rose moisture rich foamy bath cream this is from marks and spencers i absolutely love this it's got a subtle sort of floral flavor it's kind of rose scented and i just love this bottle it kind of it's a bit vintagey and i absolutely love this you can get this from MS. Next up, I'm going to show you this. This is a recent purchase of mine. This is the NYX Butt Naked Underneath It All palette. I absolutely love this. I've used it every day since I purchased it. It's got really, really nice colours in the eyeshadow palette there. And it's also got the contour and highlighter kit in the side out drawer underneath. Now, I've used this every day. I absolutely love it and I would recommend it. It was a really good price as well. I got this from Boots and it was only £20, so definitely recommend this. <clears throat> I'm also going to show you from NYX the lingerie lipstick here. This is a liquid lipstick. This is in the shade Exotic. This is what I have on today. I absolutely love this. It's a really nice sort of deep rich colour and again not too expensive and I bought this from Boots as well. This one is a really big favourite of mine. I'm definitely converted to lip liquid lipsticks now. I love them. Also, I decided to branch out and try a different mascara, so I bought the Extra 3D Lash from Rimmel London. I love this. Again, I love everything that I'm putting in my favourites for this month. I absolutely love them all. This one is great. I've got this one on today, if you can see just here. I don't need any false lashes or anything like that because my lashes are long enough, especially with this in, and it gives a really good effect when you put it on. Also, which I haven't had time to clean yet, is my Beauty Blender. I bought this from Boots. Um, this was just one of their really cheap ones, but I am totally converted to using beauty blenders. It's made everything such a sort of nice covering without patches or smears, and it blends everything really well. Absolutely impressed with these, definitely converted to beauty blenders now. I also, on a beauty note, um, rather than, well sort of a health note rather than beauty, I've got the Oral-B 3D White Toothpaste. This is a very new purchase of mine and it's been really effective. It's really started to sort of make my teeth whiter and it's it uh, makes them feel really clean as well. This one you can also get from Boots. Um, I would definitely recommend giving this a try if you want to try and lighten your teeth a little. Okay, so next up I've got some two items from M&S as well. These are from the Florentina range. This is the shower cream and the foam bath. I especially love this foam bath. It's got a beautiful little lid on there shaped like a rose. They are both floral flavours and they're really delicately scented and I think they give you a really sort of moisturised feel once you've used them. I really recommend giving them a try and they're not that expensive either. They're a good buy. Also, I've got the Baptiste Instant Hair Refresh Dry Shampoo in the Tropical Flavour. This has been a godsend. Since I discovered dry shampoo, it's been amazing. If you just need to freshen up your hair between washes or you just want to give it a bit of a boost, definitely give this a go and it smells lovely as well. Really recommend that. Um, that again, you can get that from Boots as well and they're not too expensive. You can get that in a range of different sizes as well, so you can get some that fit in your handbag as well. Uh, next up, I've got the Avon Perceive Perfume. This is a really, really nice flavour. This is um, it's like a delicate kind of scent, but it's it lingers, so it stays nice. So you still feel fresh for quite a while when you've used it. Um, and it gives a really nice perfume. And I think it comes in a cute little size as well. And it's a nice little bottle, so it sits nicely on your display. And last up, I have got the Cuff Kids Thin Hand Cream. I've got these in the mini version, so I can carry them around to my handbag. They smell really lovely, they, they're rose scented and they work really well. I suffer with dry hands pretty bad and these have transformed my hands, I definitely recommend these. So that's my top 10 beauty favourites of the month, if you enjoyed that or have any other ideas that you'd like me to do, put a note in the comments and give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you soon, bye!